Okay, we're back. So we're going to do part two of the family traditions napkin slash photo holder using this really pretty paper line from Webster's Pages called Family Traditions. Adrian Lumen. I really like it. I think it's really, it's been really fun to work with. So my mom wants me to make these for all her friends. <laughs> so I guess I better get started. Okay, so I'm going to just figure out what I want on the front of this thing. Okay, let me just distress make this first. <laughs> Donna. She's trying to fill Barb in. Two and a half hours of Italy. In college. But isn't it wonderful that you really, you don't have to watch if you don't want to. You can watch part of it. You can fast forward. <laughs> That's the nice part about the recording. That's why we don't worry too much about how long, how long we take. You guys can go, you can get some tea, you can get some tea. <laughs> I know how hard it is to tear yourselves away, but <laughs> you really can. Okay. Thinking and it's dressing. Yes, do yeah, it's true, Barb, it does help. What? To have two, although the second person is a little distracting, which is why it takes, you know, takes a little longer. Have two what? People? Two people doing the stream. Oh, well, yeah. Well, it helps having somebody watch the chat, because I think that probably is, you know, that part's kind of challenging. So. Yeah, while you're trying to work, it's true. Yeah. Did I get everybody in here? I'm trying to make sure I have everybody's names because we're doing the drawing at the end. Yeah, because John has a huge help because she'll keep track of everybody for the drawing. So that's that's really, really helpful. Okay. Yeah, exactly. My dog's now pouting down by my feet. <laughs> Mine gave up. I'm at the She's I'll take him around. out for a really good run. We'll go outside, throw the ball around. He'll be happy. I'll be good. Now, I'm going to use, this fringe is a little thicker than maybe what I would, I don't know if I would necessarily, but it's just so pretty that I wanted to use it. So I want to make sure that what I do doesn't kind of get in the way. I think that'd be good. That'll look good right there. <clears throat> and then I think I wanted to use some of the little some of the little things on these on these papers. What is mom writing? M P T F P R Sandals Giving Homie. Oh. For Christmas and I only want help. I don't know. Mom. A translation. I don't know. Something. Poity, Poity, are you I've never seen you in here. Welcome. Poity, I don't know if that's how you say Oh that. yes! No, she's from Italy. Oh, Poidi Poi how do you pronounce your name? Come stai, buongiorno. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you have to go back and watch our recording of Italy, our Italian all. <laughs> we just got back from Tuscany. Where in Italy are you from? Oh, thanks, Fran. Oh, that's cute. Fran thinks we should do a group. We should get mom to make the napkins and I'll do the holder and then we'll sell them. Oh, that's a great idea. In all our free time. Um, yeah, Money Mouse, I actually had the same thing. It's sent to a Google Drive sign-in, and I thought I fixed it. So 
Darn. Oh, oh no, Dorothy. Mm -hmm. The template is set as private and not public. Why? <laughs> I don't know. Why? Eileen just wrote, Donna, did you know that the templates are private and not public? We can't get them. Okay, go fix it. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Ciao. Ciao, Bella. <laughs> Come sta? Vorrebbe mangiare gelato? <laughs> Okay, I'm just, I'm cutting out some of these and I'm going to do a little bit of stuff on here, I think. I don't know how to fix that because I went in and it worked for me. Hmm. We'll figure, okay, well, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Who knows? <gasps> You're in the lawn. Oh, I am jello. I bet you can get some awesome buttons and trim and fabric and handbag, oh, shoes, oh. leather coats, fashion store. Do you know what? Here's something about Italy, though, you guys. Do you know you can't buy ugly clothes in Italy? Like, everything's beautiful. Everything. That is the truth. And the way they, yes, it's always the right time for gelato. That's the truth. <laughs> um, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Oh, my goodness. So, io bene e voi. Io bene e voi. Oh, she said she's well, and you? Us yes. and us? Yes. Molto bene, grazie. Um, was she right? Of course, it worked for you because she said to have quick settings and change her five to everyone. But it's just a PDF. That's what I understand. You just click here and it opens up a PDF. That is the mystery. Oh my gosh, no, Jean. Everything over there is like the size of a twig. Jim was so upset because he wanted to buy these pants and shirts and stuff. And everything was like small, extra small. I think the largest size they have is like a medium. And then, um, but I mean, even when you go like the children's stores, the way the mannequins are dressed, they're like scarves and hats and oh, shoes. And, so I mean, cute. it was just like fabulous. I mean, everything was just fabulous. But all the mannequins were like size zero. Yeah. They didn't have my shoe size. But what a go oh my gosh. Well, like we said, that was my third trip, Jana's second. I mean, ugh, amazing. We have to go back. We haven't seen everything. <laughs> did she do it as a Google Doc? Okay, hang on, I'm going back. I did do it as a Google Doc. I just created a link. That's all I did. And then I linked it. But no, it's not a Google document. Did it hijack it and make it a Google document? I'm not looking at chat, so don't talk to me. No, just go ahead and, yeah, go ahead and figure it out. <clears throat> the second one for the pattern. See, that opens right up. Yeah, it's just a, because you're okay, probably wait. signed in and you don't know it. I am, but I'm on, it says share. Uh, oh, ding, ding, ding. It is set as private. Ugh. Why? Why? You posted it last night. At, at one in the morning. I, I put, okay. It's my shoulder because my shoulder hurt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me check the first one. The first one is anyone who has the link can view. Oh, see, I didn't change that setting on that other one. Oh, well. Should I set that, though, as public on the web? Anyone who can click with that link is fine. Do anyone who can click on the link. That's the one that worked, right? Uh, yeah, she said yes. Done. Okay. okay, so let me go back um, to the share the other one then. Okay. 
I don't know if y'all can see me. I'm, I'm gluing flowers. I'm sticking flowers. I should probably, I wonder if I should do this in the other way. Let's dab the cap off. Okay. We are up and running. Oh my gosh. So I was sending people over there all day and it wasn't even working. Um, I forgive you. <laughs> Why should you forgive me? You're the one that posted it. Because, uh, because, I think I need another color here, not just the white. Oh, but we have wheat. We can put wheat in here. Okay, what's the if, yeah. Hey, Maggie. Hello, Maggie. Exactly, Maggie. That is the truth, man. Hey, welcome back, Ms. Deb. Oh, if you can join the trip from local, you might be able to. Actually, you know what, Poida, you might be able to because um, we had a couple that left the trip to fly back out of Milan. So I'm sure something like that could be arranged. <laughs> Maggie, not having any. Maggie Mix says not having anything available in your size kept your luggage full of full for good stuff. <laughs> that was the truth. Okay, Eileen said it works now. Don't let Darcy near it. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> So now you can go to scrappycambersisters.blogspot.com and get the free worksheet and the pattern. Yay. Do I have Maggie on my list? The heretofore secret private, <laughs> private pattern. It's so free, it's private. <laughs> Okay. Sweet. Sweet. Oh, I like that little wheat. That's so cute. I thought about actually, yeah, I'm just still messing with that. Should you put the trim on first? How do you know where the trim's not going to be? Quarter inch. Oh, okay. See, I don't know if you were drinking your tea when I was discussing that, but um, no, I, I, heard, <laughs> I heard you, but I just saw where you put down that orange flower. It looked a little low. Yeah, I see. I also see how I lined it up ahead, so I knew. Lined it up ahead because you want this to hang off because it'll cover the little feet. So, yeah, I think that's good. It's good right there. I think yeah, that is. I think the wheat's a little low or something. Okay. It's kind of cute right there. You want to come up? Come on, you can come sit in my lap. I know this gets deathly quiet when I'm sitting here oh, trying to think. Please, <laughs> you can't even get up on the chair right now. Do you hear stuff rattling around in my head? Um, the PDF does not have the measurements on it. The pattern? The pattern has the measurements. Does it look like this? It might not. It might not have them on there. It might not have them on there. I can add them. Okay. 
make another one of these. Okay, with that in the middle. Okay, come with that one there. That looks sweet. There are a couple buttons in there. Cause that's what I do. That's pretty come along really nice, Dorothy. I'm sorry. I'm just laughing. I did not say I wrote <laughs> about Dweedy. Dweedy. Poor Dweedy. She doesn't deserve that. Dweedy. It's sweet. Dweedy. Dweedy. I still think she doesn't deserve it. Okay, I have a couple more buttons that I want to get in here just for fun. So I'm trying to figure out, like, maybe this one's too big, maybe. Okay, Darcy, this is a problem. Moni Mouse said that the link works now. Then you click print, and it takes you to a PDF with no measurements. Are you doing the template? There's two things you have to, you have to print out. There's two things on the blog. Let me go back and check. I'm not reading chat. Don't email me. Well, okay. here's what I have to say about that. And that is, we'll fix it. We will fix it. We're fixing it. I'm going to look but at it right now. But thanks for um, thanks for letting me know because I wouldn't know if I if it if I try it and it works, then I get nervous. You know, then I think, oh, good. So yeah, I guess it just, when you're the admin, it works differently for you. Yeah, that's that's not right. That's cheating. Okay, see, it says Family Traditions Project here. You click on that. That pulls up the worksheet, which. Um, Which you should download. You really shouldn't just try to print it from there because I think that's a problem too. The cardstock sizes are on that, but that's it. And then, I mean, the chipboard sizes. And then under the pattern is here when I click on it. I like that. Um, that's kind of cool. That's got a lot of stuff on it. <laughs> yeah, mine has mine has four by six and a half, three by six and a half, four by six and a half. Uh oh, hers doesn't. Um, hmm. I wonder if I hit the zip page to screen with. Oh, maybe it's not in the screen with, and you're not seeing the sizes. I have no clue. Help! Hmm. I think this is gonna go on second. Let's do this one first. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Quadi, quadi, po, and d for the heck. I don't know how to pronounce your name. I'm sorry. I'm probably I think we it. just call yeah. We just call her Poida. I think. Um, when you downloaded it, did you see sizes? Because she says she went in and grabbed them, so I'm wondering if she sees the sizes. Oh, thanks, Barb. Jean knows everybody's name. We love her. <laughs> Back rated the PDF. <laughs> well, you can always you can email. Does not have sizes. Hmm. Okay, well then you can write them in. Let me. Write. I don't know why it's not working for you. That's crazy. Oh, uh, welcome back, Miss Chris. Okay, let's see. Did anybody, Jean, do me a favor, go in and grab the PDF for the template. And see if yours has the sizes on it. Do you mind, since you are the wizard of it all? <laughs> it's 
Not the Wizard of Oz, but the Wizard of it all. <laughs> Okay, so when I put this trim on, and I'm putting the trim on next, I start at the bottom so that you can't really see it, but I will butt it up right up end to end and it'll look, it'll look good. And then I put it slight, just slightly over the edge, not a lot, but slightly over so that you don't see the chipboard. And the cool thing about this is that you can adjust it as you go. So if you don't like it after you get all the way around, you can still move it around if you use Aileen's or Quick Dry or Beacon or something like that. Hmm, I don't know why they're not there for you, Moni. Are, are you talking about the worksheet or you're talking about the template? Or is she just saying that I didn't put the measurements on the work, you know, on the actual tutorial? Because I didn't. I can. Yeah, that's why I was asking her. Yeah. Because that would be that would be good to do <laughs> for me. Because I mean, downloaded it. She said that there were the things were there. Jean did too, and she said that the measurements were there. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, the measurements are on the pattern. Oh my gosh, Jean just kind of had a minor panic because she had paint on her arm. <laughs> Tanner the baby wipes. Was she to go into an altered state when she does those journal pages? Cause oh, because you know what, Moni? I don't know if you were here. You need to read about how to print off oh. that template because it's actually bigger. It actually needs to go with no borders. So, Darcy, you want to explain it? Yeah, it's on the blog. I explained it on the blog, but it... um. Because it's exactly 11 inches, because I try to do everything within 8.5 by 11, sometimes I succeed, sometimes I don't. This is 4, depth-wise, this is 3, and then 4. So it's a total of 11, and so the pattern goes all the way out to the edge. So what I suggested was either do borderless printing, and then, or if you have legal, and you can do legal, do legal paper. But here's what happened to mine. I did borderless printing, but my printer still kind of chopped it, so I had to actually measure and then cut my rounded corners after I printed it. And I realize that's not a perfect world, but um, it did work out. Oh, of course we would! Are you kidding? We would enter a giveaway to win it. Jamie's Hubs is. What is it? No, it doesn't depend. I know, I know what he's good. Made? What Johnny's making, I know he's good. It does not depend. All right, good, Jonna. You can wait to find out what it is, and the rest of us will. <laughs> the rest it's of us. It's a guy. It's a guy, though. What could he want? <laughs> the rest of us will fight for it. It's okay. <laughs> uh, just kidding. Uh, see, Barb, you get it. Oh, no matter. Just put my name in. Yeah, sorry about that, Money Mouse. I'll Maybe I can tweet that somehow, but I really, you know, I hate to have to cut it up into pieces and have you glue it or tape it together and whatever. And I mean, it may come to that at some point, but, but yeah, a little explanation helps, right? So what I'm doing now is I'm gluing and then I'm just putting it, just kissing the inside, at, you know, just it just comes up a little bit around the outside. Tiny, tiny bit. And it just looks pretty from the inside that way, too, if you get that little tiny bit of that trim coming up. So looks good. I'm going to check it from the inside, see if it's even. Good. Now I'll work on the bottom, which is not even. I just like the fact that, you know, it looks nice and finished, so when you're done. Okay, so I think we're ready there. See if I can straighten that out. 
see and then it's cute you'll see just a tiny bit of that of course i'm not i'm still working on that side but you'll see a tiny bit of that trim come around from the inside that looks nice so we'll do the back I guess I can lay that down now, not messing it up too much. Okay. I like this project though because I don't think it's too much work building the structure and then you can kind of have fun decorating it, you know? Did yeah. you kick your project? What did I miss? Not me. No, I said the trim just kisses the outside edge so that you can see the little curvy pieces from the inside of the folder as well. So it's just slightly outside the outside edge. And if you really wanted to, you could line the inside too. The reason I don't is because I want the bottom to be even, but shoot. If you wanted to, you could. If you wanted to use flatter trim, you could. I mean, this is, make it your project, you know. This is all twisted. I get my braid untwisted. But if I lived in Milan, I would look hot. I'm just saying. Because I would be dressed to kill. <laughs> yes, Jess, we are still here. Donna, we absolutely got to do that t-shirt, man. <laughs> we could give a free t-shirt to everybody that comes in and says that. <laughs> exactly. Hey, we um, um, we can make them up when we go wear them to CHA. Yeah. That's it. I want to make sure it looks good. <laughs> so now we're calling Barb just R. Oops. I know we, we call Barb RR sometimes because she lost her B once for Barb. She lost her letter. Yeah, we call her Barb Bark. Yeah, we called her Barb. But we called her, I guess Jean did. I don't know. Remember that, you guys, when she lost her B from her stamp set? Does she have to be RR? Welcome back, Martha. Martha, did you say it? Say it, girl. <laughs> oh, I got glue on everything. Oh, this is looking good, though, y'all. Oh, man, I got to show you this. That's pretty with that gold. Okay. I just want to make sure it looks good from the inside, too. Mom, are you working on your journal? Oh, I maybe shouldn't have said that when <gasps> she's got people in here. Well, they don't, they don't know that she's making them for anybody. Okay. She's not making sure. them. She's not making them for anybody. <laughs> Mom, are you working on your journal? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <gasps> All right, and I'm just cutting this to, so I can glue it on the bottom. Oh, that looks good. Sometimes I'll surprise myself. Well, most days I surprise myself. Those days. That's really Hey, cool. Miss Deb. Cute, cute, cute. Okay. Let me just make sure this is even, too. I mean, you really want it to try to look as even as you can get it because it kind of, it'll kind of stand out if it's not. 
and then just let it dry. That's what we got so far. See, I told Martha we were still going to be here when she got back from, from Michael's. <laughs> and literally, I just was joking because Darcy said this was going to be a really quick project. I always say yeah. that. So I didn't know we were going to be here. It's 4 o'clock. But, you know, hey, we're having a great time. It's fun. Well, if it hadn't been for that stupid Italy haul those two girls did, it would have been okay. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that's cute. All right, so that's going to have to sit, of course. Doesn't everything? All right, so then I thought what I would do is with the little dividers, I would, uh, I would, let's see. They gotta go. Are they having a good sale? I haven't been to Michael's because I haven't gone to physical therapy this week because I've been sick. Oh, we can do the buttons and we'll decorate these next. How's that? Oh my gosh, mom, are you in the right place? Yes, everyone can tell you how to do that here. Have her do the, <laughs> have her do the, the brown, tell her about the brown paper bag one. That's the one she's supposed to be doing. It was the link that Eileen gave me and to Shelly Hickok thing. Mm -hmm. and so I sent mom that link and she walked you right through it. Why, mom, are you having a problem? Um, you may need to kind of, what I did with the paper bag was. Did she wrinkle it? Kinda, yeah, you, I mixed it lightly with some water first. And I wrinkle, wrinkle, wrinkle. And then I let it out. And then I wrinkle, wrinkle, wrinkle. And then I let it out. And then I let it dry. There you go, Mom. You're going to get tons of them. <laughs> okay. Let me get the little cord out that I had for these. I'm going to do a couple different colors. I'm just going to spread my buttons. I don't want to go the other way. I'm going to go the other way. This is really, really cute. decorate them. So for those of you that don't know, my mom is trying to make faux leather. And we told her about, and I imagine there's more than one technique, but about the Shelly Hickok technique using a brown paper bag. So now John is trying to explain it to her while I am tying twine onto chipboard buttons. And we're going to decorate these. And actually, we are very close to being done. <laughs> Is Jamie here? Jamie, you recognize these scissors? Recognize these, James? <gasps> I did. I, I kind of talked. Yes, I did, actually. I did show the projects because some of them were Barb's asking about Tim's classes. One was basically decorating our book and 
and putting uh, paper in the page protectors and he showed us how to do like flaps and things and use some of the things he gave us in the kit to create our book. And so it was so nice. We just sort of hung out that night and worked or that morning, I guess it was, and worked on our book. And then the next class, he, they surprised us. This is Italy again. They surprised us with this stamp set. And he showed us how to do the watercolor technique uh, with his distress markers, which was awesome. And then the third class, we basically did more embellishments. He gave us really cool metal trinkets, gifties, and all kinds of stuff, and then basically showed us, he showed us what he was doing to his book. He did some really awesome things in his book. And just how he used some of the ephemera that we were collecting uh, for the trip. I don't know why this one's not going in. And, and then had us do our metal charm to hang off the journal. But where's the journal? But yeah, so this is what we were making and then some of the charms and stuff he gave us. Really great project. I guess I could sit here threading until I'm bored to tears. Let's see, I'm gonna try this one. It seems a little stiffer. Um Barb, go ahead and put up your link to your classes that you're doing. Oh, that's right. Barb's teaching an ornament class. I forgot. Sorry, Barb. Didn't mean to forget. Creating spaces. On Ustream, but do you also put up your um, your website where they can go and pull up if they want to join in on your classes? She's doing a class on Christmas ornaments. She's making, I believe, four different kinds, but totally different, like totally different materials each time. It's going to be awesome. Yeah, the only one that I don't think I could do is that last one because I can't really, like, draw and paint like that. Well, she teaches you. I think that's the whole point, isn't it? Like, she'll teach you how to make that. I think oh. that's, yeah. I love the little house one. She's got a little wood house. I know, and that's the one I'm talking about. They're so cute. Oh, I love that. Okay, and then for these, I just, after I get the t matching twine, I think these are so cute. After I get the matching twine put in the button, you see them? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to decorate them. So I got one more. I'm trying to get this turquoise one in, but I think it's a little thicker than the other ones. class. Okay, yes, it is a how-to class. Sorry. Oh, that's awesome. See, she would teach you how to do that. That's awesome. Um, mm -hmm. Eileen, in your dreams, baby. What did Eileen say? <laughs> she, wants, she said, I'm going to send everyone some antique chandelier glass. <laughs> no, I mean, if I can get my hands on some extra pocket page ones, um, I think I can. From I have an inside source. For what? Chandelier glass? No, what? she wants it for those pages, those pocket pages. Oh. <clears throat> for the book. Oh. Yeah, we can get those. Shoot. I am, Barb. I probably have some here. Okay. All right. Well, that was a little that was a little boring, but they do look cute. <laughs> I was going to say, 
gonna say, are you gonna make us sit through you putting string through every single one of those? Yes, I am. Cause it's my show. No, but they're cute, aren't they? You gotta admit. Yeah, I think it was EK Success used to come out with buttons and they were already pre-threaded. Oh my gosh, uh, how, was like the bomb. Yeah, how nice is that? Okay, so I'm going to just cut some stuff up to put on these. A squirrel. And for this part, you don't, you don't think too much. You just kind of, I love this little tag. Where do you see this little tag? Because really, you can put photos or journaling on your tab dividers as well. So I left them pretty simple in case you want to put a photo on that too. But look at this tag. Isn't that the cutest little bird? That is adorable. So I'm just going to cut some things and put them on here. And we got to wait. That has to dry anyway because i got to put the feet on the bottom and they'll slide around if I can't turn that thing totally upside down and rest it on, you know, a bottle or a box or something. So. I want Chinese food. Hmm. I really like this little guy. I think I'm going to use this little hedgehog too. He's so cute. I'll show you after I cut it out. I don't know what I want. Okay, why is Sharon putting a number in there? I'll tell you what. I have wanted Italian ever since I got home. It's so bad. Isn't that cute? Again, this is the Webster's Pages Family Traditions line, just so you know. So adorable. Just love it. That's really, really cute. Okay. So I'm just cutting some things out for the d dividers, the tab dividers, just to decorate them a little bit. Hey, did you hit record again when you did this segment? Yep. Okay, just checking. No, thanks. Good bad, good bad. Oh, Lordy. I'd cry. I would cry. If I had to do this over. <laughs> that probably doesn't sound good, does it? No. It's just my time is so limited. And everything takes forever. And my shoulder hurts. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> you guys, if you weren't here, we were joking about Jonna's shoulder because after she ate Kay's milk ball, malted milk balls, um, she said that it was her shoulder that made her do it. So we all started laughing and blaming everything on her shoulder. But you'll see that if you go look at the first part, which I think unfortunately defaulted to private. So when we get done, I'll go back and make it public. Oh, now Sharon's she, Sharon's blaming her arm. Aw, well she can. It's okay. It's quite all right. <laughs> Sorry, Barb. I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed today. I'm a little tired. Today, just today. Just today, though. <laughs> Just right now. Is that is that the right saying? The sharpest tool in the shed? Yeah. Okay. I thought it might have been the toolbox. I wasn't real sure. I was just checking. Oh, I don't know. I think shed's good. I like this everyday life. I want that. These, I love these parts of the of the paper line because you can kind of go in and pick and choose what you want. Grab that. I'm gonna grab some of these. Yeah, it's your kitties that made you do a lot of things. They're so cute. 
Oh my gosh, this cat. Makes me want a cat for about 10 seconds. What a couple of characters. That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> They're so funny. I want this our family. I don't know if y'all can see me. I'm just kind of having my own little reverie here. I want that one. I want this ball. And I have the little things I think are already cut out. So. So all I did on the other ones that I'll I'll show you is I just took <laughs> Gas Cam Bups, we are still here. You win a t-shirt. Yay! Jonna, start making a Yay! list. Start making a list so when we make them we can know who to send them to. Anyway, I just did really simple, like together, little resin leaf, this kind of thing. So that you can put a photo or you know, journaling, but probably a photo. So just really simple little embellishments on them, but it adds a little bit. I love this little resin owl. That came in that resin set. And a little banner. So that's what we're doing. Yeah, Jean has the green scoop that I've had. Not fun. Yeah. Yeah, Jonna got really sick when we got back. But I we thought her resistance might be low because of her shoulder, which is a legitimate, <laughs> <laughs> a legitimate shoulder reason. <laughs> but you know, because your body's trying to repair and then, you know, you get you get around something like that. Oh yeah, mom. Hot butter rum works for me. Yep. I think it's that limoncello I drank in Italy. I'm pretty sure that's what kept me going. Don't keep rum in my house. I mean, I don't drink, so I don't. It's not something I would just like keep in my house. Rum. Oh, it works though, because I was really sick last Christmas and I was at mom's and she made it. It works. I got better just in time to be able to go to Trader Joe's and Joanne's and Hobby Lobby and Olive Garden. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me get some of these scraps out of here and clean up a bit. I'm calling it the green gook because that's what the doctor told me it was. <laughs> Do, yeah, let's not talk. Can we not talk about green gook, please? I'm sorry, they're talking about it in the chat. I know. It's just me. I'm the one that gets squeamish. Oh, okay. I do. Okay. Squirrel. <laughs> Let's see. Love the little squirrely, but I want to find something where it's not competing. Aww. All right. So then I'll I just kind of look at everything. Let me get some ink. Let's just try. This came out cute. You gotta admit, it came out cute. Okay, so it's gonna ink some things. Go through and ink our little design. I'm gonna do them all at once. I'm not trying to distress them, I'm just getting rid of the white edge. We can make like little tuck spots and things. We don't have to glue them all completely down, right? Yeah, John is telling very graphic details of her flight experience from Pisa. 
you know what's really funny is she's telling the story about this kid and I'm like that's the next thing I get squeamish about is kids with their little health issues <laughs> don't read the chat for a minute I know I just almost said it and then I looked down and saw the chat and I was like oh that was next it was coming okay there were a lot of kids on that flight I don't know why but there were Secrecy, so we can't tell you what the colors are called on that palette. No kidding. <laughs> we can. Sure probably can. are. They're actually um, distress colors that are already out there. He just put them all in one palette. They are. I'll be happy to tell you what they are. They are fired brick, wild honey, salty ocean, and frayed burlap. They just put them all on one special pad for us, which made it easy to travel and everything. So it's nice. I know we did that last time, but you know what, Sharon? I suggested doing Scrappy Camper 1 and 2, and John didn't like that idea. So she thought that was even more confusing. So. Well, I think it is confusing. Plus, it would be like thing 1 and thing 2. That's us. Tweedledee, Tweedledum. I'm Tweedledee. No, you're not. <laughs> I called it first. Poodle. <laughs> Poodle. <laughs> You'll leave it there for 90 minutes. No, she'll <laughs> change. No, I'm kidding. Oh, Lordy. Okay, so I'm just going to glue some of these down. Actually, I'm going to use my ATG. Eh, I'll just keep going with this. It was fun, though. We really had a good time. And everyone, oh my gosh, two ladies that we had dinner with one night, they came up to us, I don't know, three quarters into the trip, and they said, um, you won. You won. What did what did they say? Best people on the trip? <laughs> Something like that. I go, really? Oh, yeah, they, voted us, they voted us most fun people on the trip. I said, really? Who voted? And so the two ladies go, oh, we did. Just us. <laughs> oh, it's so sweet. Happy. I don't know. We'll do a little, the little. I liked the, I liked the little. Eh, maybe I'll just leave that for now and we'll come back to it. This would be a cute pocket. I hadn't glued it all the way down. Cute. Let me just make sure. It's not going to ultimately matter when we get done. Oh no, Carrie, get the t-shirt! Oh no, she said it too? Yeah. Oh man, Donna. <laughs> She's like, hi, I'm back, and you're still here. We got to get that. We got to get that done. Get her done. The little things. That was pretty funny when Kathy, Kathy Ordo was on last night. Thanks, Eileen, for enabling. Um, but she was, she was on last night. No, I'm serious. I would not have known that she was coming on last night, so it's a good stream. But she you goes, oh. oh, yeah, I forgot. You guys do those marathon streams yeah. <laughs> on Saturday. Because she's like, I can never get, I'm not up that early to see you guys. We're like, we'll still be on. <laughs> and then somebody wrote, uh, you'll catch, I think it was Jean or Joyce. They wrote, yeah, um, don't worry. They're on all day. You'll catch them sooner or later. Love this fall. There you go, Joyce. 
Not too far. Maybe about oh, Jean wrote it. What? Jean wrote. Is that squirrel on there? What is that? What? Oh, yeah, it is a squirrel. Squirrel. I know. I loved the little squirrel. He was too cute. Love this fall. Love this fall. Love this birdie. I'm gonna put some. I'm gonna have to put some sign in there. I wanna. Oh, I wanna put him on something where he's gonna show everyday life. I know. And then we have to have like. Um, we'll have to have like marathon marathon trophies for those of you who hang in all day with us like Pablo and Jean and oh my that's gosh. That's a cool. Uh, Sharon Persimmon. Pers pers <laughs> persimmon. It doesn't, say, it doesn't say persimmon. It actually says purse one mon. Yep, with a one. Mm-hmm. Yep. <laughs> yeah, that. I mean, there's a lot of people who've been here all day. Oh, I like this. Sweet. Kathy on the bottom in the corner. Haven't been saying anything. <laughs> oh, yay, Lucy. And Lucy Jane. She's first time him. marathoner. You're for the long haul. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we say we hope some of you are actually arting, crafting something along because, you know. We don't want to be guilty of having you lose a whole day of your life watching us. You know? That would be... I mean, it would be fun, but... The dishes pile up. The laundry piles up. Everything piles up. Oh, my gosh. Kathleen Shan, I haven't seen you talk at all. She finally chimed in. Yay! <laughs> Oh, Jess, I've been up and down. I've been carrying my laptop around my house with me. Yeah, she does not sit here raptly watching. I'm just saying. Okay. So, one, two... Oh. It's true. Pablo's been here since the beginning. Yep. In fact, she was one of the ones in here before the beginning. There were several people in here before we started, like for half an hour. <laughs> Cute. I like that. I'm going to let that dry there before I start stacking them. I really want Chinese food. i got to find a Chinese place around here. You should go to that. Oh. Oh my gosh, yeah, that barbecue place is fantastic. Blue 52 is in the house. Um, Hi. Okay, I think you're pretty much done. I'm decorating both sides too, just so you know. Rusty Kitty Kathleen. Oh. Did you change your <gasps> name? Kathleen, hey. Yeah. Ah, you your name. She threw me. <laughs> How'd you get by on me? Oh, my gosh. How are you? Okay, i got to turn this on its side because I'm going to get be fixing to use it again. And let me see if I can balance <laughs> this on something. Let me see if I can balance I'm gonna have that on something. put that in my notes. What's that? Oh, who's who? What's what? Oh, that she changed her name? I'm just balancing that so I can put the legs on. The legs. The legs. Yes, that counts, JJ. In fact, you get the special award because you've been listening from your car, too. She's still in her car? No, I don't think so. I need you home. Holy cow. Okay. We really are almost done though, y'all. Did you stream changed her name for you? 
You know what? Oh, that happened that. to me. Yeah. When I first started, somebody took my name and then that was the end. And I'm like, how can somebody take my name? I already have it. Oh, yeah. How did somebody take her name? Or did they just change it on her? It said Ustream changed it for her. Oh. I know YouTube's doing that kind of junk. Mm. Let me just make sure these are even. I got to look at this and make sure it's even, y'all. This is the glass my sissy got me. It says Big Sis on it. Isn't that cute? I have to put my glue in. Oh, Sherry, tweet a picture. I want to see it. Okay. I went to JJ's art journal pages are phenomenal. But right now, yeah, because she doesn't have anything else to do other than look at people's tweets. Okay. Hey, Roger. Oh, you're talking about me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Keep her entertained, somebody, because obviously this is boring her to death. Okay. It is boring. Oh, that part was boring. Oh, JJ, get your hubs to build you a um a Murphy bed. In the closet or something, and you pull it out. Oh, for the guest, it? yeah, for the guest room, that's a good idea. Remember the one that Christopher Lowell did? It was so cool. When you shut the door, on the outside of the ca of the door, it folded down and it was a table. Remember the dining room table? Yeah, that was awesome. That was awesome. And then when and then it had then you hinged it up and there was a picture on the back. So all it looked like was this wood panel going down the side of your room, you know, the room. And then it had a picture, but then the picture was screwed to the underside of the table. So when you did the drop down table with the piano hinge, I mean, it was just the coolest thing. It was very clever. Very clever. I loved Christopher Lowell. Me too. Is he still doing stuff? I haven't seen him. I waited in line four hours to meet him once at a home show and he stayed. He, bless his heart, he stayed to the bitter end and met every single person who waited to meet him that day. It must have been horrible. <laughs> but he was, oh my gosh, he was so awesome. He spoke and he talked about how he got started and how, you know, what happened when he got his master's degree in art. And he had a really funny story about his thesis. And I don't know. I just, he, I just love him. He was so great. He is so great. Okay, so I'm just um, making this little lace trim look pretty so that I can glue it on the bottom. But I really want to wait till my feet dry so that I can do it right side up. <laughs> okay. Maybe it doesn't really matter though. Let me see. They're probably stuck on there enough. They're stuck on there enough? Yeah. I think they're stuck on there enough to hold. When I go to do the trim at the bottom, I'm lining it up so that it's just inside the trim on the sides, so just inside, and then so that this little fringy part hangs down because you've got a little bit of clearance there because of the feet, so that's where it's going to go. And that's why I like the trims that hang down. It just makes a nice clean edge on the bottom of your piece. Oh, I got the cutest fabric for, for Zippy. You did? You found some? Uh-huh. 
for oh. the curtains in the kitchen. Uh-huh. Great. Oh, my gosh. It's so cute. It's retro. It's um, aqua in, like, a taupe color. Mm -hmm. And then it has gold thread kind of outlining some of the little figures, but it's just adorable. Aww. It's, um, like, different, like a teapot, and, oh, it's just so cute. Sounds cute. So I'm going to put those over the sink, like on the curtains in the sink. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and then all along the back and the bed in the back, I'm going to do different. Okay, I'm just going to try to line this up. Line it up so it's straight. Um, this feet is, her body is 10 feet. 10 feet. And then the tongue adds another 2 feet. So she's only 12 feet small. Yeah. But 10 feet of space. It only has a double bed in the back. She's a little tiny girl. But the advantage is she's lightweight and easy to tow. So I think our theory was that we weren't going to try to go over the Rockies with, you know, like a 22-foot trailer on our first try. <laughs> I think that's kind of what we were thinking. <laughs> we were actually going to try to stay away from pretty much any mountains, weren't we? <laughs> Uh, JJ, you can put him in the tent outside your camper. <laughs> Oops. I'm going to get this straight. Bye, Martha. Thanks for hanging. Bye, Martha. Okay, that's cute. And I'll just, I'll fluff out this edge after it's dry. But there's the lacy. I'll go do the other side. Jonna, we really are almost done. There's <laughs> a drawing. Okay, that one went on pretty fast. Yay. You getting the names? Cool. All right. Just want to make sure it's even with the front. JJ, we could put, we could make it really nice. Did you see how Jim? Gentlemen crafter camps. Oh my gosh. We bring blow up mattresses. Oh, we do glamping. Yeah, this is not hardship camping, baby. You can have everything you need. Okay. Ta da. Here we are. Yay. Here's a little napkin holder with the little tabs. I don't know. I get a, I'm looking at the chats and I got to scroll back up. Okay. So you can see it. Yay. Okay, so here it is. With the little tabbies. There we go. They're not really lined up. But anyway, you get the idea. Okay. So there they are. So that's that. And then with the napkins in it. And we're ready to do the giveaway. Yay. But you don't get my mom's nice napkins. <laughs> you only get paper. Where are my paper napkins I have out? Oh, but I'm going to give you my Project Life cards because they go with the color scheme. So you'll have little Project Life cards in there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jamie's already <laughs> licking it. <laughs> Thanks, you guys. Yeah, it wasn't hard. And did we get the issues straightened out with the pattern and everything? Huh? 
hope so. Okay, Liz at 49. I don't have you in here. Let me put you in. And then, so here's the back. It's just, you can actually put a little bit of decoration on the back if you want to. And I may do that. Just put a little collage thing. But, you know, it's nice to know the back from the front. <laughs> Sometimes that can be helpful. Okay. Are we getting ready to do the drawing? Yeah, I'm going through and put, <clears throat> I've got everybody in here and they're mm -hmm. all numbered. Perfect. Everybody from the day. So you don't have to be in chat right now. You just had to be in here during the day sometime. And I put your name on the list and gave you, assigned you a number. So everybody has a number. And Darcy, just pick a number. Yep. Okay, is there like? If you do it with your little, if you do it with your thing, you'll be fine. Okay. Let's do that. With your um, bingo thing. Okay. Okay, I got one already. I got one already. Oh, 47. Okay, 47 was... Oh, good. Thanks, Gallopin. Money Man. Who? Gallopin. They're not in here right now. Were they in here before? Did you make it up? <laughs> I didn't make it up. It's a real person. Oh. I don't know who that is, though. Okay, well, we'll find her because, remember, we found the other ones that we didn't know. I mean, we were able to find them because they go to all the streams, so we'll find we'll find her. Not a problem. Okay. If anybody sees them. How do you spell it so they know to look? I put it up. Oh, okay. Gallopin. G-A-L-A-P-I-N. Okay. So if you see the recording... You can email Scrappy Camper Sisters at gmail.com and you can send us your name and address and we will um, we'll get that out to you. Yay! Uh, <clears throat> Sandy's chat wasn't working. Sandy, we did a, um, I just assigned numbers to everybody. I was galloping all the way home to see, your, to stream. see your stream, so I won. Yeah. Oh, Money Mouse said the pattern issues are solved. Thank you so much. Yay! Is Eileen telling the truth? No. <laughs> Eileen's doing really well, though. I just don't have the heart to send her to the corner today. She's just been so good. So that's our project. <laughs> and the only thing that's left, I'm going to wait for the glue to dry, and then I'm going to just trim this up just a tiny bit right here on the ends, because that should just go very neatly right into that trim. And I like to do this part afterwards and just kind of meet those edges. But I suppose you could do it before. It probably doesn't matter. So that's the last little step I'm going to have on here. And then um, we're good to go. So I hope you like them. Hope you'll try to make it. And I'm going to go ahead and stop the recording. Thanks, everybody. We're going to. If I don't hear her, if I don't hear from Gallopin or find her by my stream in December, we'll do another drawing for it. How's that? Yeah, but I mean, we'll, she shows up in the chat. But we'll give her time because remember, um, yeah. we had a couple people who won and then we were like, we didn't know if we could find them and we found them in like the next stream. <laughs> like the next person who was even on. Thanks, yeah. Elizabeth. Thank you. Thanks. Yep, so they're going to win this. They're going to win um, with the set of napkins and the little divider sheets. Oh, and then what I didn't show you as well is you can take the page, you can take photo sleeves, and you can use those in this, or you can just put your four by six photos in. But I wanted to grab some of those because this is how I've made them where I took four by six pieces of paper, you know, and I just did them in the photo sleeves. And that's what I used for inside the inside the photo display. Jamie, so. um, put up your blog so we all know where to go. Put your blog up, Jamie. Artie? And um, Artie Dar says she's not streaming because she's going to her uncle's 90th birthday party. Oh, that's so sweet. Aww. And Ms. Debron wants you to show her how to do um, a watercolor stamp. Stamp. Oh my gosh, that was so easy and so fun. <laughs> Oh, here. It was so much fun. Okay, so here's the napkins, too, just so you can see what it looks like with the napkins in it. But, um, 
that's what it looks like with napkin. And then, like I said, what I did was I used these photo sleeves and I just put four by six to the pattern paper and you can do your photos and journaling. If you do Project Life, you can do that. The other thing that you can do that I like with the photo sleeves is let's say you just want to use this as your photo display. You know, you can put your little three by four cards in here as well with the journaling. So you just do two. And they look really cute in here with your photos. I'll get them in there. Just to give you a couple ideas. I love these little cameras. So see? So you can do that too. And they'll fit, they'll fit right in there. This is the back, but you can get the idea. So that's it. So thanks everybody. I'm gonna stop the recording. We can chat for a minute because of Mr. Lag. You know how that goes. So congratulations, Gallopin. We will find you somewhere, wherever you are, and get this out to you as soon as we can. Okay, thanks guys. Thanks for watching.